All right, so what's going on, you guys? How you doing? <laughs> my bad, my bad. I was, I was about to get right to it. I didn't even. This is diversity. I was spoken. Old dog, anti imperial, the chill. One name, three personalities. Old dog, anti imperial, the chill. If you haven't seen your flowers are worth nothing to her, part one. Go back and look at part one because it's really good. I gave a free. I gave some. I gave some stuff away for free that I usually charge for. Very good. It's very important. If you haven't seen part one of this, if you haven't seen part one of your flowers are worth nothing to her, go back and look at part one. All right? After this, you can, look, you can go back and look at after this if you want to, but you can go back and look at part one. You should go back and look at part one. I gave away some free, a free gem that I usually charge for in my consultation. All right? You want a consultation? I give away a lot of like gems in my consultation. My email is in the link below. If you're watching this on YouTube right now, if you're on YouTube right now watching this, my e my email and my Instagram is in the link below. Um, TikTok also, but email me or DM me, okay, on Instagram, and we'll set up a consultation. I give away a lot of gems. Anyway, go back and watch part one of this, right? Your flowers are worth nothing, part one. Go back and watch part one. I give away a free gem. But this is part two. We're on part two. Why are we talking about part one right now? We're on part two. Old dog, anti period of chill. I know. Okay. All right. Let's get to it. So, your flowers are worth nothing. Still worth nothing to her. Part two. Your flowers are worth nothing, you guys. Okay. So, don't be one of those guys that just give flowers to a female, send flowers to a female. I know in the movies, it seems, you know, it seems romantic. It seems like that's the thing that you should do. No, 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 no. Use your time to create adventures. Stop sending the flowers. Stop sending the chocolate. Stop sending, stop sending that stuff. Call her up. Look, the guy that sends the flowers and the chocolate and all that type of romantic stuff that you see in the movies, fine. She might be like, oh, this is nice. Her friends be like, oh, those are such pretty flowers. Okay, that's great. Be the guy that calls her and be like, hey, what's going on? I'm going to come pick you up like tomorrow at 8. Be ready. But where are we going? Don't worry about that. Well, how am I supposed to dress? Just dress like casual. Or tell her, bring two different types of clothes so she don't know, like, the secret. Like, where are you going to take her? Be like, I don't know. Bring an outfit with, like, you know, something you could walk in with, with, with tennis shoes, with sneakers, and bring an outfit that you could dress up in with heels and a, and a, a skirt. Bring both. You see what I'm saying? So, she won't know where you're taking her. But yeah, forget the flowers and all that and, and, and don't do this all the time. First of all, you should be busy. Any man that has time to sit there and be on the phone with a female and this and that and this and that and be around all the time and always be available, you ain't making no money. Because people that make real money, those of us know, you don't got time to just be sitting around on the phone with a female every single day and all up under her every single day. You don't got that time. Okay? So you should be making money. And if you were if you're making real money, the way all of us are, if you're making real money, then she barely sees you. Because you're too busy. You're just not around. You don't have the time to be around. She barely sees you if you're making real money. So already she doesn't see you a lot, which is good. Okay? And so then when you do come around, you don't come around and just go to the house and Netflix and chill and do this and just sit around and watch TV. Every time you come around... She gets excited because every time you come around, you know it's going to be something different. Every time you come around, you know you're going to take her for a helicopter ride. You're going to go skydiving. You guys might go for a hike on a mountain, right? You guys might go, you know what I mean? Hey, we, we're going to, I'm going to take you. We're going to get into the, um, the airplane and we're going to go to dang, Universal Studios Orlando and go on, on, on rides for a while. We're going to go to Disney World, right? We're going to go to Disney World, Universal Studio Orlando. We're going to stay on the, at the park, in the hotel on the, at the park, at Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure. Every, you, she should barely see you. And every time she sees you, it's an adventure. It's something that sticks out in her mind to where when you contact her, she gets excited like, oh man, I wonder what we're going to do this time. Even if you don't go out to out anywhere, let's say when she's let's say when she sees you this time, you call her up. Hey, I'm coming to pick you up tomorrow around eight o'clock. You know what I'm saying? Be ready and shit. What am I supposed to wear? Just bring like three different types of clothes. Bring something casual. Bring something like athletic. 
that we could walk in and bring like a dress with, with heels, a, a skirt with heels. Just be ready, man. I'm going to pick you up tomorrow at like 8. All right? Just be ready. When you do that, if you're not going, you know, taking a flight here or whatever, or, you know, climbing a mountain or skydiving, whatever, book a beautiful hotel. And, and I was going to say fuck her brains out, but, like, make her come over and over and over. Do this. When she walks into the hotel room... Have like different sex toys laid out for her that you brought her. Make sure they're still in the package so that she knows you brought them just for her. She doesn't think like you use them on some other girl. Now you're using them on her. Buy her her own sex toy. Y'all know I'm giving sex toys to females for their for for their gifts. And this goes back to, that's why I say go back and watch part one of this. Your flowers are worth nothing to her, part one. This is part two. Go back and watch part one. Because I talk about how Christmas, how you shouldn't get her gifts on Christmas in part one. But if I do give any type of gift on Christmas or her birthday or something like that, I want my gifts to stand out. So I get her something like a sex toy. I still have females from today, from years ago, being like, man, I still got that. Remember that, remember that thing you got me? I still be using it. This from like 10 years ago. Eight years ago, seven years ago. Hey, you remember that time you brought me that? Da, 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 da. I still be using it. It still be making me come. I buy sex toys for females, so when they use it, they be like, man, I'd be using it. I'd be like, damn. Dude. Like I remember one time recently, what, like last month, this female was like, man, remember that thing? Remember those two sex toys you brought me that time for Christmas? I was like, yeah. She was like, I be using them all the time. She's like, and my um, she said her husband be like, damn, you love them damn sex toys. And he, she, she was like, little does he know that you got them for me. She's like, so every time I use them, even though I'm with him, you you come into my mind a little bit. She's like, she's like, anti, you come into my mind a little bit. When I use them, she's like, because I, you, you, you're the one that gave them to me for um, the um, my birthday, I think, or, or Christmas. She was like, so like when I'm, when I'm using it with my husband, and he's always like, man, you love them damn sex toys, like you love those 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 two sex toys are your best friends. She says her husband tells her the two sex toys I brought her are her are her are his her best friends because she used them all the time. But she told me she was like she called me up. I hadn't talked to her in a while. She was like, man, she was like, I've been using your sex toys lately. She said, so I had to call you up. It's like seven years ago, eight years ago, I got her these sex toys. She was like, so, you know what I mean? She was like, man, little does my husband know that I use them all the time. She's like, and even though I'm with him, she's like, you know, I love my husband. She said, but every time I use them, I think about you because you're the one that got them for me. Yo. I was like, girl, you crazy. She was like, so how you been? And that opened up a whole conversation with like her telling me she misses me and See what I'm saying? So now I can go use them on her if I want to, right? So, your flowers are worth nothing. Fuck the flowers. Fuck all that romantic shit you see in TV. Make it an adventure. Time is more, your time is more important to her than the flowers and gifts you can send. Flowers and gifts are okay. They're nice. But if you call her up and every time she knows that when she sees that text from you or that call from you, when your name pops up, she knows, oh, man, who knows what this, this guy is going to do for me now? Who knows what he, where he's going to take me? Who knows where we're going to go? She gets excited. Oh, where, where is it going to be this time? It, it doesn't even always have to be expensive, you guys. I have. See, but I'm not going to give away. That's free. That's the stuff you need. The Email me, hit me in the DMs on Instagram if you want a consultation. I have so many, so many great things that I just can't, I'm not going to give them out for free. So, But um, make sure you go back and watch part one of this. I give out one gem for free on part one of this um, series. Your flowers are worth nothing to her. Go back, this is part two. Go back and watch part one. I give out a free gem. Um, this is part two. Your time is more important than flowers and gifts and things like that okay give her your time make your 
you shouldn't be around because you're making money, so you, sh you shouldn't even be available to her too often. But whenever you come around, every once in a while, every once in a while, once every month and a half, once every two months maybe, once every two months, when you come around, every time you come around, she knows it's going to be a memorable experience. Every time you come around, she knows it's going to be a memorable adventure. Okay? All right, y'all. Y'all take care. Have a great day, a great night, depending on where you are in the world. Old Dog Anton, period of chill. Check the video right there. Check the video right there. You guys take care. All right, love you guys. Peace. Bye-bye.